Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a new kind of video on my channel. I'm very excited. So I want to give you guys like a body care slash body maintenance routine. For the most part, I'm, you know, doing my own maintenance. So I want to show you guys my do-it-yourself DIY body care body maintenance routine. I pride myself on being able to fulfill a lot of these services for myself, so I just want to share like my little routine with you guys and see if you guys enjoy it, if there are some pointers or some tips or just things that I can like essentially put you guys on to. So if you guys are excited for today's video, then make sure you give it a big thumbs up down below. Go ahead and click that subscribe button because there's new videos three times a week. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video. And yeah, let's just get straight into it. All right, all right, all right. So we're starting out by turning Turning on our shower, of course. I mean, we gotta get that water running. I do have eucalyptus hanging in my shower for anybody that's wondering. I have it hanging from the shower head. It smells absolutely amazing when I take my nice, hot, steamy showers. The eucalyptus is great for your skin, for your pores. It has a bunch of different health benefits, so you can definitely Google that if you want more info on that. But I knew I was gonna get questions, so. This is what my hair is looking like. I'm gonna start off by washing my hair. My hair is not that dirty. I actually washed it like three days prior to this, but in order to film this video, I wanted to give you guys my wash day like little routine as well. I'm going in with this shampoo from Shea Butter and Hibiscus Oil. It's Hask. Um, it's an anti-frizz shampoo. I really, really love this shampoo because it doesn't dry my hair out. I feel like I have, I naturally have very dry skin and I feel like my scalp is very dry too. Um, I suffer from like really bad dandruff sometimes. No, all the time. I'm not even going to cap like all the time. So I don't like shampoos that like literally strip all moisture from my hair and from my scalp because I feel like it's just too dry like it literally feels like my hair is gonna break off in the shower like under the water so I really really love this shampoo because it's actually like not drying like it's a moisturizing shampoo like it still cleans the crap out of my scalp but it's not like super dry like it literally it's so good like you just have to try it and I got this from CVS I'll have everything that I use linked down below in the description box some of them will be affiliate links just to let you guys know just like get my coin too but yeah everything will be linked down below in the description box for you guys so i'm just shampooing and making sure to really like clean my scalp clean every inch of my hair i had some gel and some oil in my hair so just like some built-up products so i just want to make sure everything is really clean and then i go in with my denman brush i just started doing this actually because i can't remember who i was watching on instagram but um, it was a curly girl and she said that she takes her Denman brush and kind of just runs it along her scalp and it just releases like any dead skin, like any extra dandruff that wouldn't normally come off if you were like scrubbing and that's like my issue like i'll literally get out the shower and i'll still have dandruff in my hair even though my hair is like squeaky clean so after i started doing that with the Denman brush game changer for me like my scalp is so 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 clear you have no idea like literally no dandruff no built-up product like my scalp is clean and it's not dry which i love even more so next i go in with my aussie three minute miracle moisture deep conditioner i love this deep conditioner it has avocado and australian jojoba oil in it and it's paraben free and you're supposed to leave it in for three minutes and it's supposed to transform your hair and that's literally what it does this is not sponsored these are all products that i bought on my own that i've been using for years i absolutely love this deep conditioner i leave it in for way longer than three minutes like sometimes i'll have this in my hair for like 30 minutes like this whole little shower routine took me about 25 minutes i'd say so i had my deep conditioner in for like pretty much the entire time and it just it really like it makes your hair feel so slick and soft and smooth like my hair just feels so moisturized after this deep conditioner like it feels amazing i love it so freaking much like i'm always like i literally always have this in my um bathroom in my shower because it's like a must at this point like i can't not use this 
So I just go in with my Denman brush and I detangle. My hair really wasn't um, too knotty because I had it in a ponytail under a wig for like a couple of days before this. So there really wasn't any like detangling that really needed to happen. But I, of course I had to still go in with my Denman brush and just make sure. And this is the hair that I lost, which wasn't much, which I was happy about. Then I'm going to go into uh, some skincare. This is an exfoliating sugar scrub from Tula Skincare. I love, love, love this skincare. This, this little um, exfoliating scrub is very moisturizing, very hydrating. It's probiotics and superfoods. So it just has a lot of like really like healthy um, super fruit and probiotics and enzyme it's an enzyme scrub like all in it um, it helps with getting rid of oil build up and any debris it has pineapple and papaya enzymes to help unclog pores it's really 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 good i got this in my ipsy glam bag plus and i've just fallen in love with it i can't wait to finish this bottle so i can get the big one um, so i leave that on my face actually the entire time that i'm shaving I'm gonna go in and I'm going to shave my legs because it's that time. I do this every two weeks. I have to shave my legs. Um, you can't really tell on camera because I'm kind of far away, but I had some stubble, you know? Like, I definitely had my legs were not baby smooth and I wanted them to be baby smooth. This refreshment shaving cream, it's the Citrus Spritz pillowy shave cream and it smells everything that i'm using i just want to like reiterate like every single item that i use it smells so good like that's like my i feel like one of my um guilty pleasures is like good smelling things like which is why i love candles like literally all that stuff so this shaving cream smells so freaking good it's so moisturizing it has a really nice slip to it so when i'm shaving the blade is just gliding over my skin i absolutely love it i'm going in with my body wash because i finished shaving and this one is from method body the peony rosewater and pink sea salt pure peace body wash um naturally derived no bad vibes that's what it says on the bottle love 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 this body wash it smells amazing as well i just feel really clean like my body just feels so clean when i use this body wash and i just can't get over how nice it smells like it just smells girly and and like pink and fresh and rosy like it's just so good so this is like definitely one of my favorite items out of my entire routine is this body wash like I'm, I think I'm going to just always use this forever and ever. <laughs> so now that my body is washed up, I'm going to go in and I'm going to wash that conditioner out of my hair. The deep conditioner I was sitting in. And I still have the face, the sugar scrub on my face as well. So I'm going to wash my face too. But can we just get into like the skin and hair for a minute? Like I've been wearing a lot of wigs as of recent and other than the weird tan line on my forehead i feel like my hair is really healthy um because that's like a protective style so the curls is popping okay look at my ear look at my ear just like i'm just in love everything looks so good next okay next i'm gonna go on with this body scrub oh my gosh this is from nubian heritage which is like the sister brand i believe of shea moisture and it's their Indian Hemp and Haitian Vetiver uh, Body Scrub. And it's softening, moisturizing, and exfoliating. It's a sugar scrub. Um, it has shea butter in it. So literally, like, with using this body scrub, I, like, I'm still going to obviously moisturize once I get out the shower. But I don't have to rush to moisturize because my skin does not feel dry. Like, literally getting out of the shower, there's such a glow and a sheen to my skin. It's so, so nice. And then I'm going to go in with my Glam Glow Bright Mud Dual Action Exfoliating Treatment Face Mask. I'm trying to give you guys, like, the full name, but I'm, I'm going to have everything linked below. But I put this mask on while I'm still in the shower, while my pores are open, my face is really clean, and... And I let it sit for like 20 minutes um, I'm pretty sure that's how long you're supposed to leave I think it's like 10 oh no it says I'm on it leave it on for a minimum of 20 minutes yeah so I leave it on for like 20 25 minutes 
always end up going over the time but really really love this um, it definitely leaves a glow to the skin once you wash it off it does have like a little bit of an exfoliant to it so I'm very gentle with applying this because I don't want to like over exfoliate my skin because I already did a sugar scrub but now we're out of the shower our body's all clean the next part is we gotta wax baby we gotta wax these armpits because I don't know if y'all noticed while I was in the shower but I got a little bit of an armpit, you know, growing. <laughs> so I'm going to go in with my waxer. This is what I got off of Amazon. And I have a full, like, video. I have a couple of videos on my wax routine. So I'll just have them linked in the description box. And then they'll also be in the corner in the little eye for you to go watch. So I'm not going to go super into depth on my wax routine. But I do wax my own armpits. And then I wax my face as well. I'm still trying to like muster up the courage to do my own Brazilians that hasn't happened yet but um, I definitely do wax myself and I absolutely love the results of waxing my armpits the amount of hair that grows back in is like literally 50% less than what it normally is when I shave like if I were to shave my armpit hairs would be so dark they'd be so long they'd be so thick and I just love what waxing does for my armpits like they're so smooth and it grows back in way slower and I'm able to wax like every two to three weeks so I washed my glam glow face mask off and now I want to wax my upper lip and my eyebrows just because we're doing maintenance, right? So we got to get everything together. Like I'm literally giving you guys the full routine. So I'm going in with some, this is cornstarch. You can use powder, you know, whatever you want to use. Um, and I'm just going to wax my upper lip. But yeah, the full routines for these because I'm about to do my brows next. And I have like full videos on all of that stuff. So... I didn't want to make this video like extremely long and show every single step but I just wanted to show you guys like the overall routine that I go through every um I mean I shower every day obviously um but like washing my hair I try to do that like once a week if I have a wig on maybe a little bit longer but like my wax routine is every two to three weeks I do my brow lamination every four to six weeks um, so my brows are all cleaned up Yes, they look so good and I'm gonna go in with my um, Lash lift kit. This is to actually um, Perm your lashes, but I use it on my brows which a lot of people on YouTube do as well I have a couple of videos on this that actually went viral for my routine um, So I'll have those linked below, but I'm just gonna very quickly this whole brow lamination literally takes like 20 minutes because you have 10 minutes for the first and then 10 minutes for the second little product that you put on and then you're done <laughs> and your brows look amazing my brows literally like whenever i brow like laminate my brows i feel like the baddest bitch ever because your brows really frame your face and i feel like this is the best my brows look is when they're laminated and they're waxed and they're tweezed and they're literally perfect no mustache anymore no armpit hairs like i'm really coming together and i this whole routine just makes me feel so good it's it's self-care at the end of the day like you're taking care of yourself you're taking care of your appearance i i strongly strongly believe in when you look good you feel good and when you feel good you do good so i try to look good as often as possible because i always want to feel good and i always want to do good so the skin is done, the brows are done. Going in with some Jamaican black castor oil, mango and papaya. Got this from the beauty supply store and I apply this directly to my scalp, the front and the back. Cause remember I told you guys, I have a very dry scalp. Normally um, a lot of dandruff just, and it's not cause my hair is dirty, like literally dryness. Like my scalp is just dry. So I have to go in with oils to compensate for that lack of moisture which is okay with me but my hair is really really soft right now like i wish you could feel it through the video because it's so soft like my hair is so soft it smells really 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 good the mango and papaya um black casserole is amazing and yeah so i decided i want to put on a little wig or whatever um it's gonna be real cute i'm just gonna slap it on and it's gonna be giving scalp because it's a bomb wig. 
And yes, I will have the wig linked down below as well because I know you guys are gonna ask for it. But I just go in with my Bold Hold Liquid Gold and I gel my hair back. And then I'm slapping this wig on that I washed and clean the lace and it's HD so she will be giving scalp okay and I'll have the video linked to how I install my wigs down below as well for you guys because I know you're going to ask <laughs> everything will be linked down below we're just sticking that wig on you see ooh ooh honey and I did like I did the customizing on this wig like I literally did all of it and I'm just so happy like so freaking pleased because it just looks so good so I just put on my little elastic band so I can really melt the lace into my skin this is like crucial and then I was like oh I want crimps like I love what this hair looks like with crimps I love middle part jet black crimped hair like it just looks so good so I went in and I crimped my hair. This is a little bit more tedious because you literally have to like stamp the crimper all the way down. So I did not show the entire process of me doing my whole head, but you guys have seen me do this like so many times before. Um, so yeah. My hair looks so freaking cute. Oh my gosh, look at the curls. Look at the, the waves, I mean, like, yes. Okay, so I did both sides of my hair, and now I'm going in with skincare. Oh my god, I love skincare. I'm taking this hyaluronic acid from The Ordinary. I absolutely love hyaluronic acid. I kind of wish I started off with a toner, but I realized I don't have one, so I need to get one. Um, but I'm starting off with serums. So this is a hyaluronic acid and this is good for moisturizing your skin. You want to do this step first. I feel like I've mastered my skincare for my skin type, which is dry. Um, my routine is just A1 for me. Like I haven't had any hiccups. I'm going in with this Sunday Riley High Dose Retinoid Serum um, and I'm applying that to my face. And this is also just really good. This is like collagen boosting, um, anti-aging. Uh, I believe it has vitamin C in it, but I'm not sure. But it's so, so, so good for your skin. I just feel like it makes my skin look very youthful and plump. Like, I know I'm not old or anything, but I still feel like it makes my skin look very youthful. Then I'm going in with this Laneige water. It's actually the water bank moisture cream. I absolutely love this moisturizer. It's a gel based moisturizer, which I usually stray away from because I feel like those are more for oily skin. But this one is super, super hydrating. Look at the glow that it gives to my skin instantly, like with me applying it. My skin is literally glowing and it's it's all it's literally all the products that I'm using. Then I go in with my Glam Glow Bright Eyes Illuminating Anti-Fatigue Eye Cream. This eye cream has like a slight little pink tint to it, but it's like brightening. I really like it. Um, and then I go in with my Marula Oil. This is the last step for me, for my skin. I need a good oil. Um, Marula Oil has so many healthy benefits to it. This one's 100% cold press, so it's like organic. There's nothing else in it. It's straight marula oil it's good for your brows it's good for your lashes it's good for your skin it's good for your baby hairs um this stuff is just really good for you so highly highly recommend and then i'm going in with my laneige lip sleeping mask oh this is a sleeping one <laughs> and i apply this to my lips because i need a nice moisturizer we gotta be moisturized okay from head to toe head to toe so this is what my face is looking like my skin is glowing i'm obsessed everything just looks so good like this routine is this is the routine like if this was one thing that i was going to go into detail about it was my skincare because i'm obsessed
so for my body products as you guys know i didn't moisturize right because you know i had the shea butter on in the shower with the body scrub but i have the matching um body lotion and then i also have the matching shea butter from the same nubian heritage indian hemp and haitian vetiver line i absolutely love all of these products because they all have neem oil in them they all have shea butter in them they're all extremely rich in essential fatty acids omega-3s really really good for your skin it literally just leaves your skin feeling so soft so smooth it smells amazing so after i do the body lotion I go in with the shea butter um, and I just hit like the, the areas that I know are going to be a little bit drier. So like my elbows and my knees, um, I hit my toes in between my toes and the heel of my foot, the bottom of my foot, literally just my whole foot. But this whole line smells absolutely amazing. I'm obsessed. And then the last thing is definitely fragrance. We want to go to bed smelling amazing. This is my replica um, by Mason Margiela Beach Walk fragrance. I absolutely love this perfume so much. It smells amazing. That was my entire body care routine. If you guys enjoyed today's video, then make sure you give it a big thumbs up down below. Don't forget to click that subscribe button down below. Turn on your post notifications. I post three times a week. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, you are smart, you are beautiful, and people love you. I love you, and I can't wait to see you on my next upload. Bye!